Hey guys, uh, it's the dude again. I know it's been a while since I've like actually made content for the Arkish community, or like just made any content in general. Um, kind of been like on a hiatus. Um, but uh, I guess you could say I'm I'm kind of back. I'm playing on um, Unchained now, on Terranos, and of course I am playing a mage. Um, but besides all that, guys, uh, I actually got something cool for you guys something that I made something that like I've compiled over the year that I play Arc Age for um, and the one thing I really enjoy about this game more than anything else besides PvP and like playing with actual friends is that I get to theorycraft a lot and being a theorycraft um, led me to be able to bring you guys this so, this is uh, the dude's true damage calculator. Um, took me about a week to make this. Uh, a lot of thinking and a lot of like math, which fucking sucked. But anyways, let's uh let's start off with the the green column first, where it says you. Now this is going to be for you, obviously, and then the values are going to be in yellow. Now the yellow portions, the yellow uh, cells are gonna be the only cells that you touch as far as inputting values in. Anything else you touch, you might mess up the actual calculator itself, so I highly advise you guys not to touch any other color other than yellow. <clears throat> now, when we go down the green column and we see spells flat damage, that number right there is the actual spells flat damage like the raw the raw number it doesn't have any amplifier ad added to it it's just the flat damage so my flat flame flame bolt damage is going to be 700 uh, 7838 all right now moving down next physical and magic uh defense pin just put your numbers in there it's pretty straightforward and your crit damage, same thing. Just put your crit damage in there. Um, personally, I feel like if you know your opponent has more than like 10,000 resilience and you have less than like 2,000 um, crit damage, don't even bother putting your crit damage in there. My calculator is already um, calculated to calculate 50% 50 50 crit rate, or crit damage, I mean, as a default because your character cannot go lower than 50% crit damage at all. Now, I skipped over damage amplifier and it's marked orange, so don't touch that number. But let's move over to the far left where it says damage amplifier. Uh, and then in big red bold letters, or white letters I mean, it says make sure you label the green boxes so you don't lose track. Now this is very important because when I was fumbling around and messing around with this calculator, Sometimes I forget that I added values in there and it throw off my values completely when I went back in the game to test out the, the damage. Now this is a good a good way to keep track of the values, right? Um, obviously if you read it, it says skill damage, 17.4%, which I have. Um, Sork 6 passive. Now this is um, what I use to let me know that, hey, this is Sorcery 6 passive, which gives you 5% uh, spell damage for sorcery skills and then fifth passive same thing this is the fifth passive in sorcery gives you 10% increase in magic damage for sorcery and then if you are a fanatic fanatic like I am huh, you know that stalker's mark gives 16% for magic and range damage and then again if you have a brain and you play mage um, you would also know that the God's Whip Flame Bolt combo will give you 12% increase in Flame Bolt damage. Now you can argue that, hey, you know, what about God's Whip? We're not talking about God's Whip right now. If I want to do God's Whip too, you know, I can go down here and duplicate, duplicate another calculator and input all the values in there. And, you know, I can be like, oh crap, look, look at my Flame Bolt damage and look at my God's Whip damage. Look, they're, yeah. You get the point. 
but that's not what we're doing here today. I'm just trying to expose you guys to this calculator so you understand how to use this when I give you guys the link. All right, now moving over to the right side where it says target. Same thing, you don't touch any other colors and other than yellow. You input your targets, defense, resilience, toughness, and damage reduction. Now, if you didn't know, um, 1K resilience is about 14% crit damage reduction. It's also a 3% crit rate reduction. Um, toughness was such a fucking bitch to figure out for this calculator. I've uh, looked through a lot of like Korean archives. I um, use a lot of different like calculators and the numbers keep changing. Um, sometimes it'll be one, uh, 1. 1.6%, sometimes it'll be 1.35%. Um, I haven't really fought anybody with over like like 4,000 um, toughness, so I can't really give you guys uh, an idea of how the scaling works, but I just know that the values that I put in here actually works. Um, going on forward now, <laughs> uh, we look at damage reduction. When you look at your stats, uh, your defense stat page, you can see that you have melee, range, and magic damage reduction. Um, you want to use, obviously, if you're a mage, you want to put that percentage in that damage reduction because if you're in melee, it's not really going to affect you. It's probably just going to throw off your end numbers altogether. So don't fuck yourself over with this. And then, of course, everything is calculated for you in the orange box in the middle. Um, the only thing you have to really pay attention to is if you have defense pin, you want to look at um, the block where it says T, D, uh, T defense minus Y defense pin, which is the calculations for um, overall defense. You take this value, you scroll over to the right. Now this chart goes from zero all the way down to 22,500. Uh, 22, and all of these percentages are generalized, um, but they are within range. So now you just go over here, it says 1200. Oh crap, find 1200, 1200 is 13%. You take 13% and you put it in the box for damage percent reduction. And then bam, you get your final number. Too easy, right? Now we're gonna go test it out and I'll be back with you guys in a bit. All right, we're in game now. So this is my target, uh, the target that we were obviously inputting values in for. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do a four backdrop, um, I'm sorry, a stock is mark four backdrop, God's Whip Fling Bolt. Now, again, with the values, which is gonna be on your left, upper left, you're gonna see the values okay and let's see if it actually holds true so let's get started okay I uh, royally fucked up there okay uh, round two uh, let's go so about like what, 8,700 and about like 5,300. So give or take about 400. So let's see. Uh, I think that's good enough. Right, yeah, so uh, non-crit non was about 6,000. Um, non-crit, 6,000. And then with the crits, uh, 8,000. So, yep. Let's go back to uh, the uh, the calculator. All right, guys, welcome back. Um, now, May and the melee are going to be switching um, positions. He is going to be the attacker, and I'm going to be the test dummy. So, again, going back to the green column and the values, and put the values for his attack and in this case we're using precision strike as a constant so his precision strike hits for 9562 he has a base stat of 
4,747 uh, 4, defense pin. The reason why you see 7,747 there is because if you're melee and you play battle rage, you know that if you proc a crit, you get 3,000 percent or 3,000 uh, defense pin. If you're two-hander, if you're one-hander, it'll be 1,000. So because he's a two-hander, it's gonna be 7,747. So in this case, for this next testing. Um, I'm gonna have my back turned towards him and he's just gonna triple slash me until he gets a crit and he's gonna hit me with precision strike. This is gonna be the most accurate way to test out um, damage. Okay, because you don't want any of your, your values to fluctuate while you're testing damage because it can give you a false reading. And because puncture is one of those false readings, you're gonna throw your numbers off. Again, going back through damage amplifier, he only has skill damage of 19.10%, um, battle rage passive of 10%. Now, right there in the middle, you see weapon proc. I am a leather mage. He has an Adachi. He has a chance to proc 15% extra damage um, at a 20% chance. Now, it can proc or it can't. We'll just have to see. Now, moving over to the right, again red target input values defense resilience toughness damage reduction you go down you look at the t def y def pin 3100 you scroll over oh look 3100 is 20 percent you unplug you plug in 20 percent bam too easy and then here is your final reading now you take this reading and you go test it in game. Crit damage will be 3,371, give or take maybe like four or 500, maybe even a thousand. I don't know, it all depends because the real issue is toughness is such a bitch to figure out. Um, and if you if he does crit, it's gonna be 5,000. And again, if we input the number for weapon proc, he has a 20% chance to proc 15% extra damage. So, too easy, like 5,600, give or take 400. Again, I'll catch you guys back after testing. All right, welcome back. So again, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn my back towards him. I allow him to triple slash me so he can get his proc off. And then let's see what his triple slash hit me for. Or I'm sorry, his precision strike, 4,000. All right. Um, let's clear this real quick so we don't get flooded with uh, unnecessary values. Let me uh, eat a sandwich. Okay, and then go again. Bam, 6,117 precision strike. Um, I don't think I saw I've seen like a weapon proc, but let's see if we can actually get a, a weapon proc. Okay, uh, fair enough, fair enough. Alright, that's that's end of it, whatever. Alright, so uh, there you guys have it. Um, the dude's true damage calculator. Um, I just want to say, I, I kind of enjoyed uh, making this calculator for you guys. Um, the sole reason why I made it in the first place was because I wanted Theorycraft. And I didn't want to spend a lot of gold or a lot of resources in, you know, trying to figure out what was the best way, uh, the best, the best route to making a build, you know. Um, so, uh, as before, everything that you see here, um, obviously the, you know, the calculator will be provided in the description down below. Um, my Discord is still there. I, I go there every once in a while, but it's, it's pretty much dead now. But you know, if you have a question, I, I will answer it whenever I get the, the chance to. But yeah, um, I enjoyed making this this video. 
I don't know if I'll be making any more though. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. There's a lot of stuff going on in uh, Terranos right now. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this calculator and use it to your guys' full advantage. Uh, because I said before, you know, you're not wasting any gold, you're not wasting anything because you already know um, certain values and now you can just plug and play and figure out what's the best route for you and your play style and for whatever fucking reason you want to use it for but yeah then again guys uh, don't let me freak ass catch you guys next time maybe all right whatever out <laughs>